everyone, it's me, Terry of the Yarn Joy Podcast. Welcome back to another video. Uh, in today's video, it is Finish It Friday, episode number four. Okay, so last week I had drew out of my little container here and I drew the unicorn kit. And here is the box. I think this, uh, it was gifted to me, I'm almost positive. Uh, and, but I think I have maybe seen this at Hobby Lobby. I'm not sure, but that's what it looks like. It is a Cottondale kit. Cottondale is the brand right there. Anyway, unicorn. This is Sophia the unicorn. So uh, that is the product project that I was uh, had drawn to work on for this week. And I finished it. In fact, I just finished it this morning. So I wanted to go ahead and show you. Here is Sophia the Unicorn, my version. <laughs> she does, she will set up, so that's good. So, lots of pieces. Um, the instructions that came in the package was um, fairly good as far as the, I mean, easy to understand as far as the actual crocheting part of it. But this assembly instructions... Um, kind of you kind of had to do it yourself you know like look at the package and i even see on here that i i sewed my parts on so then she could sit up this one i don't know see she's, she's kind of like um forward like that and i didn't do that um the placement of the mane and the tail like i said there was no instructions it was kind of weird <laughs> and i just kind of had to stitch it on using the tails like all of these colors were were separate strips like i had to chain and then slip stitch back down the chain i had to do a bunch of chains um and so they were all these little pieces and so i just kind of used the tails and sewed them in and kind of mixed them up a little bit so you know, I guess it looks okay. Uh, the tail cut pretty much the same way. I gathered it all together and uh, sewed it on. <laughs> so anyway, I think it turned out pretty, pretty cute. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So since I finished this project, that means I get to draw another one. So wonder what I'm going to be picking. So just as a uh, if a reminder, if this is your first Finish It Friday video of mine that you have, you're watching, um, I put a bunch of projects in here. They were uh, w uh, whips that I wasn't really working on much anymore, uh, sleeping whips I hadn't worked on in a long time. Um, there's, I had several crochet kits of different things like this one. <laughs> and then, uh, some that have like, you know, like the character ones, like I had a, a Star Wars kit, it's got 12 characters. I've got some other kits that are like that, that's got 12 items, patterns in, within the kit. And so, uh, I had a, a bunch of different kits like that, that, that I was given and I hadn't made, I, I was either given to them, given as gifts or, or I purchased them both. And so I thought, well, I'm going to go ahead and include them in here because I really need to work out of those kits. You know, I, I need to use them instead of them being, just them being in my closet. So that's what is in here. <laughs> and so my Finish It Fridays. Um, now, I, I don't guarantee because some of it is like, um, there's a couple of blanket projects in here. I know for sure. <laughs> and so, um, some of them, these little, so far I've been doing the project in one week and go, getting to draw another one because it's been small little items. Well, may not always be that way. Like if I, if I draw one of the blankets, um, I decided, and of course this was not my idea. It was a suggestion by a great commenter, commenter. And she suggested to just do a portion of the blanket, like six inches of the blanket, you know, and, and then go on to something else. And so I think that's a great idea. I have one blanket in here that's animals that are squares. And so I'll just do like that one square and then I'll put it back in here to, to draw again another time to do more of it. So, uh, so some of these, it may not be one in one week. Uh, so far, I've been doing completing the project in one week. So, <laughs> we'll see um, if I can keep that up or not. We'll see. <laughs> but anyway, let's go ahead and pick out the next item to see what uh, this next week's project is going to be for Finish It Friday. Okay. 
And so like the unicorn one, just to know, I picked the unicorn one. I just had this single, this was a single item in a kit. So I took the unicorn paper out and I didn't put it back in there. <laughs> Some of these other ones, they have multiple items in the kit. So I just put it back in, you know. Anyway, okay. I have something. Let's see what it is. It is... Ah, Star Wars. Okay, so it's the Star Wars kit again. Um, now, I did have Star Wars. I, I, I did say that I was going to put it back in the container if I drew it again, if I did it like two weeks in a row, the same kit. But I had the unicorn um, kit uh, in between there. So I'll go ahead and get the Star Wars kit out the box. Let me get it. Okay, so here is the Star Wars kit. Uh, last week, oh no, week for week before last, I did the Yoda in the kit. Okay, and it does have the has the yarn and well with this kit it has the yarn, the stuffing, and and the all the the things that you need, the safety eyes and all that for just these two characters, the stormtrooper and the Yoda. But there uh, there's actually twelve. All those and all those <laughs> uh, characters in the kit. So, last week I did the Yoda because it, it already has the yarn and everything for it. And so, I guess what I'll... Not last week. Week before last. Anyway. I will... Uh, I think for this next item, since I'm, I was working with the yarn they gave me, I think I'll go ahead and do the Stormtrooper next. Because because it's in the yarn is in there and then after that I will have to get my own yarn it's DK weight yarn I have to supplement my own um, but the pattern is in here okay <laughs> so that is my next project for next week it's it's going to be small um, I had the Yoda right here so I can show you that okay so there was the Yoda the stormtrooper looks like he's going to be a little taller than Yoda <laughs> but um, so I, I should have that done. And that means next Friday, for Finish It Friday, episode number five, I will get to pick something else. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and... Let me put that right there. I'm going to go ahead and since there's more characters in that kit, I'm going to take the paper and I will put it back into the container to draw again another time. And of course, if I draw it again next week, I'll put it back in there and then I'll draw something else. So that way, two weeks in a row, I won't be working out of the same kit just to make it more variety and more interesting. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go. I hope you enjoyed this Finish It Friday. And uh, comment down below those that are, um, I've had commenters that said that you have um, been working on your own version of Finish It Friday, and so I hope that you're doing well with that, um, you, and I'm so happy that you're putting your own spin to it as far as finishing whips or whatever it is you want to um, use to draw, you know, for your items that you're drawing from, <laughs> and so let me down, know down below if you're doing that, how you're doing on it, if you're still keeping up with it, and if you're making good progress, um, so yeah, <laughs> um, yeah, that's it, I guess. I hope everybody's having a going to have a wonderful weekend coming up. This is Friday. We made it through another week. And uh, I will be back, uh, let's see, probably on Wednesday for Crafting with Friends. And I will let you know, as always, I'll let you know what I'm going to be doing this weekend, you know, after the fact. <laughs> so um, I hope everybody has a wonderful weekend. Stay cool or stay warm, depending on where you're at. <laughs> And, um, yeah, ch uh, we'll meet back up on Wednesday and, and have another visit. Okay. So until then, see you later. <laughs> we'll see you in the next video. <laughs> Bye.